welcome uh, family to our weekend war. Um, we're up against, well, I can't pronounce that, but it's Arab Barrage War. Uh, I'm actually going for the flip. Normally I don't use, uh, I don't split my flags. But then I figured out there's a way to kind of make it where it, the video would um, link. <clears throat> so let's see here. Um, like if you have it in pieces is what I'm referring to. Um, instead of it trans transitioning very nice without it looking kind of like cut and paste. All right, so I saw these three teams, and I think this one would be probably the easiest to... I mean, as Cernia Tang, she, it's not like she's non-threatening. Um, she's slow, which, you know, um, gives the advantage to the other... Um, to Actually, to the, to the offense team. Um, I'm hoping to go red with this one. They have a four-star here, which I think I might be able to... Um, might be able to defeat this. And I haven't figured out what I'm going to use for these two teams yet. This team looks pretty easy with their uh, four-star heroes there. I just, I'm thinking I might go blue here. All right, and this one I'm not sure yet. So, um, and I and I know at past videos I talked about this book. Well, it's sort of, I would describe it as my playbook and Basically, uh, I did it so I can uh, write all these tips down with the intentions of doing tutorials, which ergo I'm doing now to, you know, to a degree. So in this book, I have pretty much the teams I use for my Tavern of Legends, and I have all the, the different um, heroes for, you know, all these quests that they had, and I would give out tips within my... Um, alliance you know about different gameplay and you know hero building and fighting the titans and and what to do with the challenge events and what best heroes to use for this type of stuff and um i'm hoping to continue that um anyway let's uh let's begin uh let's go with uh, i think i could do it get away with using a red team here and uh my classic I know it normally doesn't make sense to go weak against, pick a team that's weak against the the tank. You know, you would think green, but uh, at the same time, you also want to evaluate the tank and see how much of a threat they are, and uh, depending on the war type. So if this was rush attack, I probably wouldn't use this team against the Sarnia, although um, I'm more or less thinking of the uh, the flank right here where I want to use reds against her. And if she does minions, I have him. And then also to counter those minions with fiends. Because if you put enough fiends on a minion hero, it end up pushing out their minions. So that's the reasoning behind that team. And I have Annabelle to dispel any nonsense. Okay, so let's go for, for this right here. Wait, although I want him to go first, so that's why I put on the highest troop. Since he's very fast, I don't really need, well, she needs a faster troop than he does. So, as I mentioned, the idea is always from Brimstone to go first. Because his fiends will apply this right here, this uh, defense against fire. And as long as his fiends stay there, then any attack after that will be minus four. Minus fifty four percent defense against um against fire heroes and that's why following with Elizabeth and then Gravemaker usually will kill him. Okay, so let's uh let's go with this and let's see what the boards. Even though you take the right counters, the boards will always have a major influence on on the outcome of the game. Especially rush attack where it's very vital to play very strategic with your boards. Arrow Barrage and the, all the other versions, you do have a more of a window to play with the board if it doesn't start out favorable. All right, so. And uh, you always want to try to make things happen in the least amount of move possible. So with gameplay, you do want to plan ahead on where tiles are going to fall. 
It takes strategy to do it, and it's taken me a long time. But watching other videos has helped me to learn different strategies. All right, so um, let's see what I'm going to do. Hmm. Okay, I think I'm going to do this dark match, this uh, um, horizontal match to bring the reds up and hopefully get some more reds. And then if I do this, I should get, maybe I should do this first. All right, look at that, a red diamond. You can see him. All right, I'm just going to use Grave Maker because I'll be able to power him up again once I pop that red diamond and hopefully get him back up. Why do they always go for my healer? Ugh. But I think I can still take them out. Now, with Ureus, he applies that sand damage regardless if they have fiends or um, minions there. Okay. Okay, let's go for a, um I kind of want to go blue with this one. I'm going to use my opposite blue team. I have two blue teams. And then also in my book I set up teams, so well, war team specifically. Um, and I tried my best to utilize all of, you know, some of my best heroes, um, whether they be epic heroes or um, epic or your legendary heroes. Um, in this case, well, for this team, I have... Uh, Wait, that's kind of reminded me. One second. That's reminded me to put the do not disturb, which it throws me off key, off balance since I'm actually starting this video a little bit different time than I'm used to. All right. So normally with this one, oh, okay. I have Dark Lord and Ferent. So let's see here. Um... I have a Dispel, which, well, I don't know why he's in the corner, because actually he would be best. Well, see, I understand why they did this, because you have a blue tank, and you don't want to put your healers next to each other. But then again, he's not benefiting at, well, to his full potential because of his um, ailment protection for himself and his allies, so he would be best as a wing. All right. Um, all right. I think I'm just gonna go with the team that I normally have. I I, I like to mix it up with fast and um, um, fast and average heroes. They're gonna all be average, which is not ideal. Um. Hmm. Let's see here. And. When I build my teams, I prefer to go weak against a tank. So, I'm, wait, I'm actually going to need a cleanser for this one because of, well, of him. But it's, and he dispels. You can dispel what he does. So, Frida's good for that and dispelling that. And, um, 
Hmm. Maybe I might use a hero that I normally don't use here. Because I don't really get too many. Hmm. I feel like I need to save Dark Lords for something else. I think I need to go. Hmm. Let me check this out again. I should get a second healer. Hmm. Okay, but I still need a fast hero, which. Hmm. I kind of was thinking yellow. No, I already got yellow. So green, a green hero. Um, actually, he might be beneficial here because he uh, reduces their healing and they're relying on healing. They only really have these two major attackers. Well, he's also a pretty good hero. All right. He's used a lot for a hero of the month. I'm very surprised by that. Oh. Let's see here. Let me see if I remember. And with these games, you know, yeah, I used to get mad at all my losses, but you have to take all these losses as a way to improve for next time. Always keep in mind how you did the last time. Troops are looking good. Technically, I don't want. No, it's okay. Let's let's go with this. Okay. Not an ideal board. What I plan to do is use this uh, vertical match for the greens to the blues and hopefully although I have a yellow match that I want to use. Oh, so if I match that at the top, it might change this, these yellows down there if I start from the from the top. Let's try it out, see what happens. See? Okay. I'm going to do the same with this right here. This red match to, to, it'll match these blues over here in the corner. This horizontal red match. I think I need to take out the right side. Okay, so I chose that side because underneath I have like matching tiles. Yeah, well, follow up matching tiles, I should say accurately. Vivigo will 
dispel that anyway. He's going to take more than one special to defeat. Probably gone away with just using one healer. All right. So, this one's going to be a lot tougher. I don't think I'm going to defeat it. However, let's give it a shot, though. Um, I want something to combat him so he can end up uh, affecting himself. So, that's where Sonia comes in. I know she's a very old hero, but she I use her against every um, Holy Titan. Um, let's see here. I don't want to go darks, but I think in this case I will. Um, let's go here. Wait, wait, he's from my green team, but... Even this one might be a good one to use. And um, let's see here. I think I'll use Dark Lord. I feel like this one I'm probably going to need two healers because of the strength of this team. Vivica would have been nice if kept here. Use that. I'm gonna be a mismatch team, so mm -hmm. let's use that. Let's use her. And this is kind of a hodgepodge, but the idea is to use um, Arsenia to um, reflect what this guy does and her element protection and cleanse. I think she does a minus attack, does she? Oh no, the other one does. And it, well, he does fiends and stuff. So let's let's go with this. And he's the only one I don't have uh, um, like a counter against. But I'm gonna use her to at least reduce their mana. So let's go with this. This team is outside of my means, but it's an opportunity to flip the board. Um, let's see here. I'm going to use... Let's, first of all, let's take this. I'm going to take that move right there. I'm going to use this... Uh, ooh, this uh, vertical green to do the reds to the purples. I should get rid of him before she heals him. Yeah, let's do that.
gets killed before he can use his special. Hmm. I didn't think I'd be able to defeat this team, but I wanted to at least go for the flip. Looks like the only thing I could really do, I really can't do much, if I could at least. Man, if they didn't kill Gullen Bursty. I'm not going to do any damage to. gonna try to damage him as much as possible. Maybe I can get a kill here. Oh, she's gonna heal. shot and it'll be a little bit easier um, for someone else to go through that ghost in lane. I mean they're pretty beefy so maybe if I had gone green sometimes when they have these elemental heroes that the boards will tend to spawn um, tiles for that hero. Alright uh, we'll be back for our um, part two. Alright now it's time to use the remaining three flags can't even, don't even remember the lot. It's like 12 hours passed by. Well, let's see here. Um, it's 186. 191. I did this team already. 180. 186. So I think I'm going to go after this one. Oh, man. This would have been perfect to use it uh, with... Or Santa, but I think I already used her earlier, didn't I, huh? Mm, yeah, I did. She's right over there. Uh, let's see here. I think I want to try this one. He's not too dangerous of a tank. Let's see. I think I'm going to use... Huh. And then... I don't think I have a lot of... Uh, no, we won't use Rodeus this time. I use Dark Lord. Hmm. Did I use Devon already? Oh no, I didn't. Do I have buffs to dispel? Not entirely, just his. And maybe the one that he places. Who'd be it? Hmm. 
what color do I want to use? Blue or red? Actually, I want to use a green hero. So let's put her here just in case I end up selecting a healer. Okay. Hmm. We got a green. I don't really need this spell. What do I have in red? Let's see what we got going on here. Kind of wanted to use a green hero, but I have yet to use them, huh? Hmm. So wait, am I going to use... I might be able to use one of my green heroes because I, I don't think I'm going to use both green teams. What do I have left? Um, wait, let me, let me disassemble this one real quick. I think I'll use my two green team so let's see here what am i going to use here i feel like i need to go darks okay I feel like I want to use June for the next. I think we're going to save our Dark Heroes. Um, hmm. Do they have minions? No, I don't think I'm going to end up using my blue team. So. Hmm. Hmm. Let's see here. Green. Yellow. I'm really stuck on who to use. Uh, let's. Yeah, I'm just gonna go with good old Proteus. Uh, let's see how our troops look. I just recently leveled this one up not too long ago. Uh. So, a yellow into a yellow is always a fantastic idea. So, I think what I'm going to do is take, wait a minute. Okay. So, I'm going to do this to hit those greens. It'll bring that purple up. Hopefully, they'll get some more yellows. Let's lower the volume. Oh, I didn't expect all that. Sure, a lot of blues. 
She's a cleric. Is I mean, he's a cleric. Is he going to? Oh boy. Let's try to see if we can get yellows. No, perfect. It's not going to hold him for long. Please hit anyone but Azalar. Well, that was fun. There's a whole lot of freaking blue. That's all they want to really give me. I guess that's the color of the day. Hmm. This is going south real fast. My healer, right? Oh. Hindsight, that was a. Uh oh. Let's see, what is she at? 942. There's no way Drake Fawn could kill her. Hmm. Oh, we gotta try it anyway. <laughs> I. This board is a mess. Uh, I can't have Heemdale heal. <laughs> well, we're just going to try to get as much damage. Fantastic. Ah, this was this was fun. Yeah, that's that's fun. Yeah, it's fun being walloped. Giving tiles for for colors you don't even possess. <laughs> Ingenious. Alright, let's see here. Um this time we're gonna need a let's see here. Um did I say greens for this one? Alright, so I think I'm gonna go with this green team but since I don't have Proteus I'm gonna have to do it like that let's see if we can give him the 17 so he could power up a little bit faster dispel although I would like a oh I got a better idea Okay. 
Let's hope this works. Woo, like a bag of Skittles. All right, let's see what we're gonna do here. Hmm. Okay, I'm gonna do this horizontal match, and then after I'm gonna do the purple. Hopefully it bring some greens up. God, he's only a sniper. That's enough. That's enough. We don't need Atlanta running them up. See what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna have to get greens up. So I'm gonna do this vertical. Let's see. This vertical red match into Vivica. we have left on counterattack one 129 I don't think we have let's try this hopefully no He's going to kill everyone. <laughs> ah, wow. It's fun. Okay, let's see here. Oh, what's FOMA? FOMA at home in a coma. Wow, this is ending up pretty darn nicely. Uh, why not? Probably don't have a chance, but there's always a power of positive thinking. <laughs> All right, let's see here. Okay. So I'm wondering, do I need a dispel? I Is she the, uh, oh, she's the original Mother North. So we really don't need it too much. Can I get at least a three out of three? That would be fun. Ah, <sighs> okay. I gotta look back and see what I did wrong that last, that last match. Boy, 
They're gonna make me work for everything. I'm gonna do this dark match to the blues and see what happens there. I don't know how much that helped. <laughs> okay, okay. I have a chance. Okay, this is what we're going to do. We're going to get rid of Ariel. sick of evade <laughs> of course of course uh who wants to make a bet she'll hit regard okay so place your bets who will she hit will it be a Alber? Will it be B, custom Jew number two? Will it be C, Kingston? D, custom regard two? Or the lovely Quinnell? Let's find out. My guess is regard. Place your bets now. Ooh, I was wrong. How many times she's going to? Oh, she just gave up. All right. <laughs> it's nice to at least not lose all of them. Three out of three. Not satisfying, but not phone tossing angry. <laughs> Seven thirty-three. Oh, so I ain't gonna lie. I forgot to change my team again. So let's see what we got here. We got a one shot. And then right here, hit me twice. Hit me twice, shame on you. And another one shot. And a hit me twice. Not bad. All right, well, let's see what we got going on here. We have 13 flags. I think I have someone that can at least clean up two of those teams. Maybe all three, that's, he has six. And then they have 13, wait, 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 wait. 13 and 13. Wow. We actually have like, a, what is that? 388 point lead. Hmm, I think we have a great chance of winning this one. All right, well, thanks for watching, and I'll catch you for the next video. Peace out, and I mean it. Bye.